putting in the big electrolytic capacitor, the 2200 microfarad capacitor, <clears throat> make sure that you t uh, begin with a minus right on this side here. There's a long lead and a short lead. The long lead's the positive, the short lead is the minus. It's also very well marked minus. You see the holes right here. You put the plus in the upper hole right there and the minus into the hole with a big solder pad on it. Push it through the board like that. Push it all the way through. Flip the board over. Then with a pair of needle nose, as I said, I'm sorry for the shaking, but uh, there's, no, uh, there's no way to hold the camera and work at the same time, so I just have to bear with it. Then I take and bend this to make a loop like this. This I want to tie this over to the ground connection right here. And just make a loop right here. Where am I? Right here. And you're going to solder the negative of the filter without shorting it to the center here. You're going to solder the negative to the pad here and then solder here for more rigidity. The positive wire is going to go over to the regulator put a piece of heat shrink tubing on it. This is going to go over the regulator here to the input of the regulator. Again, making sure it does not short on the ground and it does not short on any other terminal. Now at this point, take the 10 ohm resistor, the 1 watt 10 ohm resistor, and you're going to see there's two little holes that are left here on the board right here. And put the 10 ohm resistor down into those two little holes. Okay, come on, find the... Where are we? Here we are. There's one here, and push it down into the hole here, and get it, try to do this, get it in, where am I, oh boy, come on back here, there we go, come on now, get in the hole, this is not, uh, not very easy to do, because, again, I'm working with one hand, which is basically impossible. There we go. Oops, almost. Come on, bear with me. There we go. Push you down into here. There it is. Okay, push the resistor in like that. The resistor is going to go to the short lead of the resistor is going gonna, is gonna to fold over and join the positive lead of the filter capacitor. Right like that. These two are going to join each other. I didn't quite bend this right. Come on. There we go. The, that resistor wire is going to join this filter wire and be soldered, and then the end of the filter wire goes to the first terminal, the beginning, the input of the regulator. Cut this wire off after you make, and cut it off maybe about there, and then form a loop in it. And that's going to be your main power input, 12 to 24 volt input, DC input. That's going to be the positive side of your input. All right, we'll revisit this in a minute.